Welcome to this special Northridge fixed mailbag session. I've purchased some new tools for my workshop and I've been watching some videos from Northridge fix and found some items of interest that I bought. Here's a complete list and uh, I'll show you uh, the items and unbox them uh, here. So the first item is this uh, USB charger. And uh, that's a nice display and we have some USB-A ports and two USB-C ports. And it's main powered. There must be some power wire here. Oh, and you see this is uh, with a US plug and uh, it's, it doesn't work here in Europe. Uh, here we have uh, another type of connectors. So yeah, I come, I'm going to replace this connector. Uh, please bear in mind when you buy stuff from the US that they use other connectors. The next item is some glue. This is like a universal type of glue. So I can see that he often uses this for fixing broken off connectors and stuff like that. And the third item is um, a, a camera. It actually consists of many different parts. So here we have the camera and it has a HDMI port that where we can connect a frame grabber or uh, an external monitor. Quite sturdy quality. I think I will make a review of this camera in another video. And again, we have the same issue with the power supply. There's a mouse included as well for configuring. And a USB. Oh, that's a HDMI cable for the monitor. And also along with the camera, there are some other stuff. We have some different lenses. Here we have an... 108 times optical zoom lens. Also very sturdy quality. Just take the end cap off here. And then we have some Barlow lenses so that we can have a better view of the things going on on the table. So you can actually increase the view with these lenses. There's another one here. So they, they are just going to be attached to the 108 times lens. And there's also a ring adapter for attaching the whole assembly to a stand. And then we have a microscope anti glare unit. So this is this box here. And there we have some two light sources, connectors that goes into these ones. And here we can adjust the intensity of the light on off switch. And the DC input jacket, and again US plug. Next item. That's a ninety-six LED microscope lights that goes on to the microscope. Um, and here you can adjust the intensity of the light. So I will have to play a bit with that and show you that in the next video. Then we have some microscope or some um, high precision multimeter probes. This is this kit here. And here you actually see the very pointy tips.
Okay. And then we have a voltmeter, amp meter. This is this box. This is good for testing, so you can see how much current is actually being drawn by your device. If there's a problem with charging and so on, then you can actually see it here in the display how much current is being drawn. It's a very nice utility. Then we have some flux. I bought the two different kinds of flux, MTEC flux. So they also come with the syringes and some tips here for applying flux. And then we have some, some bottles here for alcohol or it could be oil or different kinds of lubricants. And in here there's also a tip. Can just take this off. It's a very fine needle here. And then there's a brush. That's for just for cleaning the PCB. If there are some hardened flux, there are two different ends here. Then we have some jumbo wire. There's two different kinds I bought. One type is just without insulation, and the one is in a melt where it doesn't short circuit if you put it on the PCB you actually have to burn off uh, the insulation so they come quite in quite handy then we have the grinding tool battery powered I think you can actually charge it via USB port I don't know if there is power on it already. And there are some tips here included. Just some different tools for grinding the PCBs. And then some tweezers. So this is a tweezer with a very fine tip. The one I have presently is not that good. So I look forward to be using this one. And then we have some heat resistant um, mats. He has one in just in silicon. So these should be able to handle up to 500 degrees. So I don't uh, destroy my work bench. And um, Alex was kind enough to also give me a couple of gifts. So let's see what's in here. So there's this curved screen disassembler. So you can get in and remove a display or some plastics without damaging the items themselves. And what is this? Just have a look on that. Ah, this is a tool for gripping. You know, if you lose a part and it's hard to get out, then you can actually use this one to grip them. 
Cool. And then we have some needle probes. Straight and bent, super fine needles. Let's see how to get into this box. That's okay. Yeah, they are very, very high precision and very fine. This is actually with the bent tip. And this one must be the one with the straight tip. Oh, it's very hard to get there. Yeah, that it was. So it's very good for if you have to apply something or just peek to a pin or something to see if it's soldered. So that's cool. Thank you, Alex. Um, yeah, so in the next video, I will show you how to use the microscope and give you a review of that. And uh, I will try to enjoy the rest of the time with my new tools here. So, yeah, see you in the next video. Bye.